Hi, I appreciate you tuning in. It takes a lot of effort to drive quality traffic to one's website. This is going to be a tip to show you how once you get that traffic to get the most out of it and to keep it on your site. Uh, now here this is a, um, a gold uh, nugget site and we're on an inside page. If you look up over here at the URL uh, you'll see it's an inside page. Here's the backslash. Now let's say whether the uh, the page that they're navigating to on your site is missing or somebody sends it or calls somebody a about it and they mistype a letter. So let's take out the M from minor here now in this uh, in this URL and then see what happens when we click the forward button. And this is what happens, and this is what happens on most sites. You'll get an error page that looks like this. And basically it says that that page couldn't be found, and they give you a search box and you can type in. Now this is a search box from Google, so the server hosting company is making money on this. These people are uh, ethical enough to put a, uh, a note here that any money that they do make from it goes to charity. That's nice, but there are a lot of other uh, servers who keep this money and actually uh, in a more uh, deceptive way know if they're hosting let's say a bunch of law sites or a bunch of real estate sites put ads here for other law sites or real estate sites so should they get this error page it'll actually give them some of your competitor sites to go to and you would lose that potential client forever so this is something you want to change on your site right away now let's take a look at our main SEO site which is right here this is an inside this is a page on on the site and let's say we went inside to look at one of our um, uh, well this is an inside page excuse me this is our where we talk about our SEO videos that you can view uh, so if you go up over here you'll see the URL here's the backslash and that's the uh, name of the page well on this page let's do a similar thing let's take out the uh, the I in video and then uh, tell it to go forward well now you see instead of getting that error page you have a custom error page that we set up ourselves even with a little animation here but more importantly than that is the fact that it tells them they couldn't find the page and it gives them a link so they stay on your page or go back to your page so if they would click here you see it takes them back to your main page over here and this is what you should have on your site in the next video we're going to tell you how to make a simple error page just like that and how to get it up and working on your site uh, now let's take a look on the real estate site here here's the real estate site let's say we go to the search the MLS and some error comes up here or again somebody calls somebody and says they found something on here they gives them give them the address and they mistype it so let's take uh, for instance the M out of MLS in the address here it could be anything so we just take the M out we hit it forward and there's another custom error page that we created now this one says uh, they could not locate the page may be down for upgrading please click the links below and this is the links the most popular links for the site here's the home page here's the index page here's back to the search the MLS page uh, real estate activity uh, agent referrals monthly happenings etc so here they can if they were trying to get to one of these sites or they just want to go back to the home page they would just click the link right there and there they are right back on the uh, on the home page so uh, it's very easy to do but the main thing is make sure you're not losing business by not having a custom error redirect page so check your site right away and stay tuned we're going to have another video coming out shortly showing you a very easy way to make your own custom uh, error page for your site appreciate you listening take care